Hello, and welcome to part three of the Prussians, the Kingdom of Prussia. Okie dokie, so where we last left off, we had crushed the, um, we had crushed Luxembourg and her, and her forces. Now, Soon I tell you soon. Soon I tell you soon. We will defeat the Austrians. No matter what the cost may be. Okay, so so one of the Brazilian parties have been annihilated. So you got these guys? So you got the So I have reason to believe these guys win. But, uh, who knows? So, in, yeah. Russia. Hello, Zlenin. Zlenin. His name's Zlenin now. Zlenin. <laughs> His name is Bresnant. What is this? Genghis Khan the second. Wait, 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 to let you know I am. Yeah, we're gonna do a collaboration government. Well, actually, that would have been a lot more useful if they had stayed together because I could have took something like Prague and that would have been half their nation. <laughs> yeah, so now we are left here. Um, not knowing what to do. I'm gonna save two, I get a hundred to get this. I'm never actually gonna do this. It's just to get, um, uh, thing called air experience. Okay, so I'm getting naval experience. And, uh, I don't know if I should wait until they're at 100%. Or not. If I go to all the way down here, they're at like 50%. So they're halfway trained. Wrath of the Dramas. Be afraid. Be very afraid. Of the mighty demons. Yeah. <sighs> I'm a nutball. I'm a wing nut. Yeah, so, um. Huh. I'll probably just do that because that's 70 days. Um. So I could do this. But now I'm gonna do this so I could get all three of them. But we'll do um how is this? I'll do this one. Um okay, yeah, so August one Mackinson. Um French Empire announces National Mobilization Act. And as I predicted, they're going down this one. And then they do My Fet's Dream, which basically says something. I don't know what this is, but like, it feels like it's just saying, um, Constitutional Manor. And right now, this is what I'm scared of. Uh, a little thing called this. Little thing called, um, declares the war on the, the Prussians. So we got a pursuit of eternal peace, and that's where they go down this path. Keep out the Prussian eagle. Hold back the Italians. Defend against the Kaiser. Which basically just says, I don't want to deal with them. And then we have a pursuit of eternal peace. We have which basically says Cold War. Explains of the fears uh, that the Germans and whatnot accomplished what Bonaparte couldn't and collaborated with the Russians. So basically saying um, Cold War between Austria, the Russians, and them. War on Hungry Sharks. 
Cost is one. Uh -huh. Hmm. So, uh, we got the Japanese. Oh no. So it's eventually gonna end up being something, which is something. Okay, so, um, okay, they, they should just be good at deploy units instantly. So that's him done, so we can move him to the border with these guys, which basically says I could move him with him now. Um, I'll wait for this to finish, then I'll do this. And I trained enough divisions to the point where I could do invade this guy. Um, so I'm going to wait for this to finish, though. Uh, I could very much train another army if I wanted to. I'm not really going to join this one. Usually I would, but I don't really want to have intervention with this. Pity conflicts are none of our concern. Um, either way, these guys are gonna win, but if the Black Hand does succeed, I will do focus on the European whatnot. And it requires all the following. I, like... We could do, like, this here. And, like, here, and, um, ask Swiss to join. So, basically, you can have, first of all, you can have the Swiss join and the Black Hand, which basically gives Austria a two-front war from down in the south from the Black Hand, Italy from here, Russia from here, Kingdom of Prussia from north, and then he also got the Swedish, which will probably most likely take care of the Danish socialist and hold the front line and whatnot. Yes, I know I could train divisions, bud, but just give me five freaking minutes to build my economy. Okay, so let's do, uh, which basic, uh, let's get rid of these demilitarized zone that we had to do in the first Vilkrieg. Um, uh, no. How do you pronounce that? Not the Vittel Krieg. Um. Winden Sphere? Here, hold on. Let me go here because it says it here. Um. Prepare for the second. Prepare for the second. Prepare for the second. What? Where's it at? Or Orden? Whatever that is. Post. Italy the horn in the Horn of Africa. Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. If Italy controls this here... Oh, for a second I thought these were collaboration governments and we're like, Hey, uh, want to let you know that uh, Benito Mussolini's down south. Wait, what? Okay, what is this? Where's it at? Is it on- is, is it in the French one? Now that just reinforced continental lines. Um... Mm -hmm. Is it on the Russian one? No, that's not it. Austrian. Maybe it's on this one. It's prepare for the second something. Prepare for the second Vilmor? Is that what that is? Hold on, sorry. Uh, the remnants of Prussia. So... So basically you have rival French and you got the Greater Austrian, or you could do the German Confederation, it basically says form Germany but as a puppet state of Austria. Huey Long. Huh. I think it's the second Vilmark though, or something having to do with it because something having to do with Austria winning a, uh, a winning, like, Germany winning, like, some type of, uh, civil comp, uh, some type of disagreement between the Italians, the Russians, and the 
uh, in Prussia, which I think got us this land and this, but the Austrian Taiwan thing. You had to demilitarize this and let and don't like do something here. I think, but I don't know nothing about this mob. So okay, so military factories, military factories, and military factories. <laughs> Mills, mills everywhere, mills, mills everywhere, mill, 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 mills, mill, mills, mill, mills, 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 That's done. And let's invade these guys. You need to go here. Whenever we're done finishing them off, I will train. I don't know. What not divisions? I'm gonna train 14. Actually, okay, let's get rid of two. I'll train 12. Uh, 12 in Berlin and just put them against these guys here. Um, but after I take these guys, these guys are really just here to like train and whatnot. But with my, how big my industry is, it shouldn't be hard. It shouldn't be too hard to deal with each one of the threats against our glorious empire. Okay, so that's basically more naval experience. Um, I, I forgot if I ever finished this. No, this never finished. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do a carrier. Or if I'm going to focus on a destroyer. Like a destroyer type. We got death charges against, uh, submarines. We got heavy ships. And whatnot. Whoa! Whoa, 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 boy. Oceanian state and who? And who now? Um, fine. You are at war with who? A British Oceania. But wait, aren't they in the Commonwealth? Okay, this is a weird, but, okay, okay, let's do over on Saxony, and then just instantly deploy these troops whenever they're ready, um, I know I said I wanted to get these guys at least trained, but this, um, the end of the Zordom in Russia, okay, alrighty, I'm gonna read this though, already as a fragile, fragile, fragile republic, Russia has decided to end the Zardom once and for all. Vladimir Lenin, fearing a, per, a potential rival from right-wing movement, has finally stripped the Tsar of all of his titles. Nicholas is now immortal. 300 years of the Romanov dynasty has come to a close. A new dawn for Russia. Prussian invasion of Saxony. Shattering news from German... Shattering news from... Germany today, the Kingdom of Prussia, under August von Mackensen, launched a full fledged invasion of the Kingdom of Saxony, a close friend to the Austrian Empire. As it expands its borders, Prussia looks to be closer and closer to German unification every day as the nation prepares for a final struggle against Austria. For now, though, they could wipe up the remaining independent German states, while well, Austria can only sit back and watch. You're up on her knees. Oh boy. Ooh, baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. Germany is gonna rule Europe. Ooh, baby. Ooh. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, evade. Okay, 
team, wait for these guys to finish, wait for these guys to finish, and three, two, one, deploy, you guys go. Move him immediately to you, uh, the 12, the extra 12 divisions later, but you, but I'm under you, um, you guys go, <coughs> bless me, you guys go there, uh, I'll train another 12 divisions, bam, 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 go here, go there, I realize this, don't care, go, 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 baby, do, oh, well, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna wait for, uh, no, 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 I'll do this, no, no, I don't know what to do, okay, um, okay, that's that done, uh, you know what, let's just focus on the 19, oh, uh, let's do this, here, ooh, uh, -huh. Yeah, so Okay, Saxony. Okay, so I want to let you guys know this will be the final part of this series. If you want to call it this. Um this will be the third part, and will be the final episode today, at least. So that is them finished off, and I will be putting you guys here. So, um, we still have Annex Hanover. So, um, I think we're gonna finish off Hanover in the next one. Uh... In the next video, which will be tomorrow, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video of, well, at least the final part for today, of the Kingdom of Prussia, and I hope you guys really like this new series that I'm coming up uh, with this series, and whenever I finish this series, either die, either, di either get oofed trying to form the greatness of Germany, or succeed in defeating the French, Austrians, and Russians. But before we do end this, Vladimir Lenin. So, so you have dealing with the Habsburg hegemony. So you have to do this. So a dawn for a new Russia increases that, and then Red Giant awakes. Okay, hold on. Let me see the name. Um, Russian Republic. Why won't the zoom out? Hold on, sorry. Nope, wrong one. Ugh. Yeah, Russian Republic. So, what focus does Lenin have to do? Oh yeah, so here. Denounce the House of Romanov, and the Tsar never again. So, right here. So, he's pretty much getting close to doing the Red Giant Awakes. Um... So he's pretty much just gone down here. Lenin the Iron Hearted, Lenin the Negotiator. Um, if and if maybe just for the jokes, I might actually go down the Lenin path as Russia. <laughs> really, just for the jokes, and go down Troxy's thing. But I highly doubt it. But uh, I hope you guys liked this video or part three of the Kingdom of Prussia, our the Bundeskrieg Prussia series. And, uh, please watch the other two parts before this, uh, because there are some amazing videos. There are some amazing videos. Uh, and I want to let you know that the peak upload title, uh, for all y'all to know is in October, um, my birthday, which will be the peak thing. So the first week of October, um, will be my peak upload time, uh, with, first of all, new games, uh, maybe some, maybe starting vlogs, if I can, if I could, or can, but, uh, I hope you guys enjoy the series, and, uh, have a holly jolly day, have a wonderful day, and see ya!